should stand strong and pray because your journey in marriage has not been smooth, but you finally made this one. It has not been smooth. A breakup somewhere, and now you have this one. You need to stand strong. Yes. I'm seeing spirit of anger. Yes, you are like the anger comes, and what you feel is it, like, don't do this, don't do this. You keep reporting, keep reporting, and keep building up. And when this cup is filled, it's become very difficult for you to control. Yes, sir. And that keeps you off. Hey, stay your own. Let me stay my own. True, Two of you are not, are not repeating, mm. recalling what had happened in the past. Right. And are using very it against him. Very true. That's true. It, very this true. is the person you know very well. Yeah. Yes, sir. She's my wife. You are not comfortable with that, this particular weakness she has. Yes, sir. You are like, if you did like this, I wouldn't mind to stay without any woman because I, I came from somewhere, another marriage, and this is the one I think I was believing is going to work. Yes. But because of this, let me stay. Yes. So this problem will come to an end now. Amen. You are working on something. Sir? You are working on something. Yes, sir. There is a plan on board. Okay, sir. Fear not. Okay, sir. It will work out. Okay, sir. It will work out. Amen. You have an encounter with strange woman in the dream. Mm -hmm. Anytime that is, you are at the point of breakthrough, mm. this woman appears mm. to attack you. Mm. And anything you put your hand has not been working out at all. Okay, sir. So the end has come to that problem. Man, I will welcome you to the City of Jesus International Ministry today in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Tell us your name and where you come from. My name is Tina Waboise. I'm from Frisco, Texas, USA. And uh, tell us, ma'am, how do you use it to you? This is my dear husband, Victor Waboise. Both of you are all the way from Texas, USA. Is that what you are saying? Yes, we are from Texas, USA. So you are welcome. But tell us now. Uh, today in the service, the man of God, Christopher Oji, came to you and gave you a prophecy. Tell us what he told you. He came to me and he said something about anger. He said um, it builds up and then you explode, which I would confirm that to be 100% true. Um, I tend to get angry easily, especially when provoked. And it's something that has been affecting my marriage negatively so i thank god today that god used um his servant uh, christopher orgy to um fish out the issue and deliver me to the glory of his name hallelujah how does it affect your marriage please explain it has affected it in the sense that it has brought disunity um, once it happens like um it was as if Christo um, the prophet was just in present when it happens so we tend to stay disintegrated and everybody we stay away from each other and it has brought disunity but i thank god that god has brought solution to it completely um it has affected even fruitfulness even when it's time to be together as couples the anger will come and bring disunity and everybody would go their way and what is supposed to be done at the right time will not be done. So this has affected it negatively. And um, it, it tends to happen that even when I will get angry and it's as if the anger will come at a certain time when I conceive and before you know it, the conception will, I will lose the conception all in the name of this anger too. And um, it has caused miscarriages as well in my marriage. So. Se more than seven times. I've had miscarriage more than seven times. I stopped counting after the seventh time. But I believe God today that it's over. So, with having received uh, today's prophecy uh, from the man of God, Christopher Oji, what do you believe that this uh, prophecy has uh, done for you and your family in general? It has brought complete deliverance um, because I don't know um, um, Christopher Oji from anywhere. 
I've never met him one on one. I've never been. This is actually my first time here. So when he was saying it, it only has to be from God, and it is time for God to visit me. So by using his prophet, I believe that he has brought complete deliverance because, you know, the Bible says that some of these things will not be revealed just like that, but by the Spirit of God. So I believe the Spirit of God revealed it to his prophet and. He said it to me, so by so doing, I believe it has brought deliverance and liberation to my marriage and to myself personally. Amen. Pray God Almighty, in his infinite mercy, give you put the grace to live and please God Almighty, having received today's prophecy in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Okay, you said the man beside you is your husband, right? Yes. Can we hear from him? So I welcome to the city of Jesus International Ministry today in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Tell us your name and where you come from, please. Uh, my name is Victor Wabuze. Uh We are from Fresco, Texas, USA. Okay, today you have the opportunity of meeting the man of God, Christopher OG, one on one, and he spoke to you. Was a prophecy tell us what he told you? Yeah, every prophecy that uh, the prophet, people call him wise man. I don't call him wise man, I call him prophet. You know, because it's only God that opened the eyes of a prophet to see something that's going on in your home and in your heart. You know, and everything the prophet said is perfect, is hundred percent. So it uh, said things about my wife anger and personally for me, you know, I like a woman, anytime something good wants to come in, a woman comes in to make love and that twat those things away, you know. And uh, you know, I confirmed that to be true. And he told me again that about uh, about uh, something I'm looking forward to. I should not be afraid. I should go ahead and it shall be well. In Jesus' name. So have we received today's prophecy? What do you believe that God Almighty has done for you through this prophecy? You go how much I've done something great. This is one of the major things that brought me from US. You understand? Apart from the the other one, this one thing that brought me out, that brought me down. And the prophet says something. I have never even discussed with my wife one day. You know, he said, sometimes when she gets swing into that anger, I look at her like, what is this? Is this somebody I want to stay with? Or do I have to look out there for someone else? You know, and that is what the enemy, the spirit wanted to do, to break, to dissolve the marriage. But God never gave me that kind of mind and power to do such a thing. You know, but I keep telling my wife that whatever happens, I don't have no anger against her in my heart. You understand? She has found it difficult to believe, you know, because this, the way she gets angry. But I, for one, I don't get angry like that. Because I keep telling her that nothing, when the Spirit or the Holy Spirit is with you, such thing cannot stay in your heart. Because those people don't dwell in such environment. But every prophecy the man of God has given us today, it's a great deliverance in our life. And it works into our marriage to make our marriage more perfect. And make our, we can build our love, you know, in the mighty name of Jesus. That, uh, that relationship now, from now, that we know what it is now, we we'll start working on it and we're praying about it. Because we know, as many of us pray, we are completely delivered in Jesus' name. Yeah. Next, we're coming back. We're coming back for testimony. A big testimony. In Jesus' name, Amen. We thank God for your life. Pray God Almighty give you more and more blessings, amen. so that you can live for Him and glorify Him in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen, Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. We are delivered. Thank you, Jesus. We are delivered.